course, um, they, they the, like the coaches have been preparing for us. We try to always um, to understand the uh, position, and and we we've come to the same conclusion about um, Thomas. I, I played I played when I was playing Super Rugby against him a couple of times. It's likewise with uh, Alemano and and Petty. I think Petty is injured at the moment, but but um, yeah, tough guys. Um, like what you mentioned, Feisty, they 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 don't back off, and and um, and I think we we sort of revel in, in those contests as well. We we like to compete every day in the training is competition, and and um, of course we can't be too feisty in trainings. It's about the match, so um, yeah, we we everyone's excited about it, man. Selection. Um, yeah, of course. Firstly. 100% a lot of competition, which I think is good for any rugby team. Um, uh, a lot of guys played more than 50 games. JK has played, everyone knows, for, for the national team in Ireland. Um, so we we push each other every day in training. Like what Travis mentioned earlier, the level of competition amongst, I think, in many positions is high. For me, um, I, I don't want to think about trying to secure for myself a place. I think that's dangerous. That's not what rugby is about. Rugby is about a team. I have to to do my job in the team to 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 make the team to be better, to improve the level of the team. I have to try to do that, and of course, we we do that in training with the with the other second rows as well. I I think probably probably the obvious one is uh, is uh, what happened in '95 with the World Cup. Um, that that is. What he's done not only for for rugby but but for the countries it, it was it was incredible and and um, I think for for me I, I almost perceive Ellis Park to be the home the home of the Springboks you know is is if you, in most countries uh, they usually have one stadium where the national team plays all the time of course in South Africa there's many good stadiums but Ellis Park it, it always has that feeling of you know it's the home of, of, of the national team and 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 to have been there also with Lions I think altitude is a big thing of course for for opposition and and um, luckily for us we will be we've been um, uh, training up here for a couple of weeks and and hopefully we can take advantage of that is it is that the big difference for the opposition I'm not sure I think we'll have to ask him but um yeah, of course, it feels just feels like the home of the Springboks and, and it's an in inspirational stadium for us. For, for me, I, I'm incredibly inspired by a guy like Gibbon for, for what he's done for, for South Africa or what he's done in South African rugby over the last, I don't know how many years, uh, caps over 110 caps. Um, yeah, he's, a, he's an inspirational guy for for myself and, and for the team, Jens, the, the captaincy, and Jens is a big leader in the team. Um, and, and yeah, I think for what he helps for me also in the match is the calmness. Uh, I'm sure if you can, if you can, some people probably when there's a bit of a, a scuffle, he doesn't look calm, but <laughs> in, 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 in other stuff, he's, in, he's incredibly calm. And, and I guess it comes with experience. He's done, he's done it for over so many matches, and um, maybe sometimes it's a bit of pressure or hastiness, and he, he just brings a like, calmness, and, and of course, it helps for me as well.